Sock company Bombas was born out of a mission to help those in need. The business began after its co-founders learned socks are the most requested clothing item at homeless shelters. The company spent two years designing what it calls the best performing sock on the market. They launched Bombas in 2013 with a buy one, donate one concept. For every sock they sell, they donate one to someone in, in need. And today, more than two million socks have been donated. Bombas County, Bombas company founders, co-founders, Randy Goldberg and Dave Heath join us now in Studio 57. Gentlemen, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Yeah. Tell us a little, done? Uh, pretty good. Tell us how you decided to get into the sock market, because that's not where you started. No, it's, uh, I don't think anybody, uh, nobody starts there. <laughs> no, nobody dreams uh, when they're five years old of yeah, running a sock socks. company. Yes. Uh, but uh, five years ago, Randy and I were working together at a media company, uh, and I came across a quote on Facebook that said that socks were the number one most requested clothing item at homeless shelters. Uh, it was a fact that kind of stood out to me as being both, you know, interesting and, you know, upsetting at kind of the same Why time. Why is it socks, though, not so, coats and gloves? Yeah, so first of all, socks are a wear-through item, so most people don't, you know, donate socks, but also shelters uh, won't accept used socks. You know, there's yeah. hygiene reasons, um, and, you know, if you're homeless, you're on, you're constantly walking around, and, and it's one of the items that you go through uh, the most. Yeah. There's I nothing thought, better than putting on a clean pair, clean true. pair of socks in it's many true. ways. So where did the name Bombus come from? Bombus comes from the Latin word for bumblebee. Mm -hmm. um, we took inspiration from bees. They're small, but they have a big impact on the world. And they live in a hive, and they work together to make their world a better place. So our mantra is be better, and that's knit into every pair of Bombas socks. I love that oh, yeah. mantra, be better. But I, I was talking to somebody, a producer, when she was briefing me this morning, said, I love their socks. They're so comfortable. And I said, oh, come on, Mary Alice. All <laughs> socks are comfortable. What's comfortable <laughs> no. about Bombas? She said they don't slide, and they have some little padding on it. So Can we I hire thought, her? Okay, yeah. Yeah, right. <laughs> and, she make, said, and she said, I'm wearing them today. How do you so, make a better sock? Yes. Right. Well, yeah. you, you start from a consumer perspective, right? So we weren't insider apparel guys. We looked at the sock and we said, what are the things that we don't like about socks when you really start to focus on it? And the, the toe seam and yeah. the arch support and certain things that the, the type of cotton that we use and all of those things combined to make an amazingly comfortable sock. Well, according to Mary Alice, you're doing a lovely job. <laughs> so now you're planning to do 60,000 socks, give away 60,000 socks in one day. What does that mean? How do you do that? Yeah, and so, why are you doing that? Yeah, so, so we found out that on any given night, uh, 60,000 men, women, and children uh, experience homelessness here in New York City. Um, since homeless is obviously a cause that's close to our heart, uh, we wanted to help bring awareness to this issue. And so as a team, we're constantly going out and uh, donating our time together to homeless shelters. But we wanted to figure out how can we bring uh, awareness to this issue and get other people involved. So on Tuesday, we're getting 60 of uh, the top New York City companies uh, together. We're assigning them to 60 different shelters, and we're giving out 60,000 pairs of socks in one night. You made a bet that... Uh, that um You'd celebrate after you donated a million pairs of socks. Yeah. We thought it would take 10 years, yeah. take two and a half years. Yeah. And then all of a sudden the bet was, Dave said, Dave said to me, when we hit a million pairs donated, I'll get a tattoo to celebrate. Did and you I do said, that? Deal. I did. Where yeah. is it? I have it tattooed on my arm. Our logo and our slogan, Be Better. We filmed it. I promise you got it. <laughs> you can look up the video online. It's, uh, well, it's right there. Yeah, we got it's it. right We're showing there. it. Yep. We're showing it. Well, <laughs> did it hurt, Dave? <laughs> nah. Okay. All right. And the company is profitable? Are you? Yeah, yeah. So last year, uh, we did over $17.2 million, wow. uh, and we're very profitable last year as well. Your parents must be proud. Yeah, they are very proud. What does yeah. your son do? Socks. All right. Socks. <laughs> Congrats, guys. He sells Thank a you. lot of socks. Yeah, a lot. A lot of socks. Congrats. Andy Goldberg and Dave Heath, great to have you Thank here. You Thank you very much. We'll all be better.